hello everyone welcome to google meet tutorials in this video we are going to see how can you record a meeting in google meet so in different apps like zoom they provide you a feature to record the meeting but in google meet there is no built-in kind of a feature that is available so if you want to record a meeting that is going on in google meet then how can you record it that is the question so the process is very simple all you need to do is have a screen recording software. So if you're using a mobile for your meeting, then the process is very simple. Uh, usually in the notifications panel in the apps, actually, you will have that screen recording app uh, into your phone. Otherwise, you can just download any of the trusted screen recording apps from to your uh, Google Play Store or App Store and then use that for screen recording. But in the case of PC, the process is a little different. In place of trusting any of the third party apps although you can use third party apps like obs studio camtasia software and uh, filmora or pinnacle or any of these softwares you can use for recording your screen but if you don't want to go into the whole process of installing a software just to record a google meet then there is a shortcut that is available and that is what we are going to discuss in this video the process is pretty simple all you need to do is uh, go to your search bar and search for PPT. This will bring up Microsoft PowerPoint 2016 or basically whichever version you have available. So that would be um, brought up in front of you. Okay, so open a blank presentation. Once you have opened the blank presentation, then what you need to do is go on to this insert tab. So this insert tab allows you to insert different types of media. In case you don't want to record the meeting in the form of a video and just want a screenshot, you want to just capture a screen. So what you can do is just click on this screenshot button in the insert tab. This is present in the images group and here you will get this whole screen. So you can just click on that and that whole screen would be taken as a screenshot into your presentation. This you can use later on. You can show to everyone. You can save it, everything. Just delete it. So this is one step of taking a screenshot. What is the other step of taking a screenshot and that is the shortcut, the print screen button if it is present on your keyboard that you can use or you can use the shortcut which is windows key shift key and the S. So windows shift S will allow you to take this kind of a snip or a screenshot of your screen that also you can do to take a screenshot and that would automatically be copied to your clipboard. But what if not the image but you want to like record a screen you want a video then how are you going to proceed with that again we go to the presentation the powerpoint presentation go to the insert tab this time move all the way in the right to the media group here you will see there is an option of a screen recording that allows you to insert a screen recording by recording your computer screen and the related audio so just click on that screen recording it first asks you to select a custom area if you want the whole area that also you can select but if you want a custom area that you want to select this we can select so this much of area i want to record okay so this area i have selected you want to record the communication device or the mic this you can select you want to record the pointer or not this you can select and then click on uh, this record button to start the recording or you can use windows key shift and the r shortcut to start the recording let's just start the recording so this also gives you the process to quit this recording which is windows key shift and the q button so just start it uh, record everything now whatever is happening outside of the screen this won't be recorded only the actions taken inside the selected area would be recorded once you are done use the shortcut which is windows key shift and the q and the recording would be stopped and it would be inserted automatically into your powerpoint presentation if you want to play this recording simply you can just click on this play button and this recording would be played and you can see the pointer is recorded it's going here and there so with this you can see that the recording is done right now uh, my pointer is outside of the screen so that is not recorded only the area when the pointer is inside that area which you have selected that only would be recorded so that's it for this video on how you can actually record a screen um and that's it thanks for watching